All right, let us introduce the principle of mathematical induction. If you read a math textbook, they'll probably say that the principle of mathematical induction constitutes a formal proof that a particular proposition is true. While this is correct, it's also very hard to understand. Let us break it down into a few simple steps on how we can actually apply mathematical induction to a question. Here's the question. The first step is to test for the base case. In this case, the base case happens when n is equals to 0, so we're going to substitute 0 into the proposition. We obtain 2, which proves the proposition. The second step is to assume the proposition is true for n equals to k. In this example, it means that it's a multiple of 2 as shown. Finally, we use the result in step 2 to prove for the situation where n is equals to k plus 1. We are able to show that 2 is also a factor in this situation, proving the statement by mathematical induction. Here's a visualization of what happened. 